Worry and concern in Salt Lake City after a suspicious death outside a downtown motel. The discovery came late this morning in a field between 5th South and 6th South. A nearby business saying this is just the latest troubling situation around there. New specialist Lauren Steinbrecher digging into this tonight as police continue to investigate. Lauren. Yeah, Dan and Debbie, so police here trying to look into how that person died, uh, which is part of what makes this suspicious, but it's also where that person was found that is raising their suspicions while raising issues over safety for that business. From across the street. Saw that there was a lot of activity going on. Preston Wood would find out. Suspicious body found. As he watched police cars and crime scene tapes around a field next to the Motel 6. Across from his business, Love Communications, on 200 West between 5th and 6th South. Salt Lake City PD says someone called them Sunday morning after finding the body. It's not apparent yet how this person died or how they ended up in a field. They're going to conduct a very thorough and methodical investigation, trying to work back in time to piece everything together to try to figure out who this person is. But they've called in their homicide team. And this body was found in an open field here in downtown Salt Lake City, so that itself kind of raises the hair on the back of our necks, indicating that something isn't right here. Wood will tell you something isn't right a lot of the time across the street, saying activity around the motel. I've been here on a Sunday once and watch somebody get pulled out of a body bag. Has been an ongoing issue. I was surprised that all of a sudden there's a coroner, there's a cops just like this and they're pulling him out of the truck. And this latest situation, just another example. Yeah, it's always a big concern for us and it's a concern for employee safety. Yeah, and Wood's saying that he has purchased security cameras. He's dealt with attempted break-ins at uh, his business. I contacted Salt Lake City Police about that. They said that that area is an area that is already a focus for them. They have increased some safety efforts there, uh, but they also meet with businesses regularly about their concerns. Dan. Yeah, unfortunate situation there. Thanks a lot. Lauren Steinbrecher live for us tonight.